everybody. I just wanted to come on here hey and guys. say hi. Hi. <laughs> I'm actually about to start filming a cleaning video for my other channel, but I just wanted to come in here. Come on here and say hi. hi. You done with school, boy? Yeah. Yeah? Did you learn anything new today? Well, I... Oh, yeah. No, excuse the bag that's on the stair, y'all. We have to get that off the stairs, but it's full of mail. We have to go through. Okay, so what? You learned something? I you I learned just, nothing? I just, the whole thing about school is just our learning packets. Your learning packets? Yes, and just, we just do easy stuff. You do easy stuff? Yes. It's easy for you, huh? Yes. <laughs> just the easy stuff. It's easy stuff? Yeah. That's because you're so smart. So my husband is about to pull, you guys, all this in here is my decor. But... Don't judge me because this is for every season and every holiday that I decorate with. And I basically decorate for every season and every holiday besides um, St. Patrick's Day. So he is going to be pulling out my spring decor. Do you hate doing this? Get used to it. <laughs> I love that man, y'all. He never really complains. Sometimes. Sometimes, you know, he give me a look. <laughs> you hear that frog? <laughs> <laughs> So I'm sitting here working at my desk. I'm currently editing a video and trying to juggle a couple of things, but I just wanted to show you guys this. So I got this from Home Goods, and I absolutely love it because I am a list maker. Absolutely, I make a list every single day of things to do, um, things I want to accomplish, whatever the case may be. Anyways, so I like how this is already like um, written out for me. Uh, wake up and work, and then you get to put the the day and the month up here. You have a daily intention, your to-do list, you pri prioritize it, you get to put your meal plan and how much water you've intake for the day. And then once you complete a task, you can put put it down here or you can just you know make yourself a, a box like I do and then your top three accomplishments. Anyways, I love things like this because it really helps to keep me focused. Sorry for the lighting, it's probably not the best right now. But I love things like this because as soon as I wake up in the morning, actually what I've been trying to do is do it before I go to bed for the next day. But if I'm not able to do that, then I just get up early before anybody and I fill this out. And I don't remember how much it costs, but this is the brand. So I just want to share this Walmart grocery haul with you guys. I'm not sure how much we spend. I'll put it right here on the screen. But then after I share the grocery haul, I'm going to also share a few items from a couple of other places. Starting over here, we got six boxes of the Jiffy cornbread mix, a thing of yellow cake. You guys, I made some cake with chocolate frosting. And one of you guys gave me the tip to, instead of using water, use milk and Something else, I can't remember what I did. But anyways, that made the cake, so, box cake so moist. And um, they, my family ate it super quick. So I have to make another one. We picked up some Butter Lovers popcorn, ketchup, Parmesan cheese, kosher pickles, some Olive Garden croutons, some Quaker oatmeal, Capri Suns, some corn dogs, pizza bagels, some boneless skinless chicken breast, and boneless skinless chicken breast tenderloins. A box of chips for the kids snack bin, some honey wheat bread. As far as dairy, I got some eggs, salted butter, and then a couple of things of Blue Bonnet. For whatever reason, our Walmarts don't always have this, so when we see it, we like to get a couple, and I just put them in the freezer. Some sour cream, almond milk, and then my husband got himself a Smirnoff ice. What flavor is this? This is the orange flavor. Got some potatoes, onion, tomatoes, and watermelon. And then for things that are non-food, got some Crest Bar soap, some Clorox wipes. You guys, I haven't seen them in a package like this in forever. So when my husband brought that home, I was really happy. But some Clorox wipes, two things of Lysol spray, some Easy Off Fume-Free uh, oven cleaner. 
And thanks to you guys on my other channel, I don't know, there are so many people who told me that they use the Easy Off. And I used that in the past for actually a couple years, but I stopped using it because it was so strong. But now they make fume free, so I'm happy about that. And then shout out to my mom, because if you guys do watch me on my other channel, you guys know that I have been looking for this Method Wood for Good. You know that it is my favorite, and I have not been able to find it in stores probably since... Um, I don't know, this whole COVID thing started, but she picked me up two of these, so I'm really, really excited about that. Some paper plates, and then paper bowls. As far as the things that didn't come from Walmart, I got this blanket from Amazon. If you guys seen my spring decor haul, then you know there's two pillows that I got from Kirkland's, and this blanket matches perfectly. It's really soft, and I cannot wait to wash it and put it on the couch. And then from the Target dollar spot, my mom found me this, um, what is this called? A riser or pedestal, but it's super cute with the bunny. And then from Bath and Body Works, you guys, this is my favorite spray for the house. I also like leaves, but leaves is only, it's a seasonal spray. And then two lemon mint leaf candles. They did not have the best deal. I think they were $16, $15.95 or $15.99. Um, but that's not the best deal, but this is my absolute favorite spring, um, spring candle and I only have like three or four favorites from Bath and Body Works and this is definitely right underneath leaves so leaves is first and this is maybe all, all, all maybe it's almost tying with it but um this is my favorite lemon mint leaf so these are the breakfast sandwiches that I made my husband and oldest daughter say hi papa do you want an energy hug <laughs> are you guys so I've already cooked dinner for today let me show you what I made I made some cornbread some green beans, homemade mashed potatoes, but I moved them to this Tupperware so I could clean the pot because I don't want to have a whole yeah. bunch of pots in my sink. And then I made some Salisbury steak. That's what the Salisbury steak is looking like with the sauteed onions. Then I also made a brownie cookie, but as you can see, a couple of slices are gone already. You guys, look at all these lemons on my lemon tree. I need to pick some. Riley, I'm and then there are oranges up in this one. I don't know if you can see them that well. They smell so good. Right now I'm cleaning them in some water and vinegar. Okay you guys, so our new treadmill came and I am so excited right now. We are trying to pair it and set the Wi-Fi up on it. Okay guys, so this is super cool. Look, everything is touch screen. Sorry about the, the lighting. There's a glare, so I'm trying to do it to where you guys can see. Oh, okay. My husband turned off the light. Let's see. Okay, so like there's just different type of workouts. And then it tells you like the time. You get to see the trainer. Oh my goodness. I'm about to have fun with this, y'all. There's beginner. Well, it makes you, it has you fill out your profile before you even start. So they just know I'm a beginner, okay? But the, I think most of these are beginner. But it lets you do, well, you pick between um, like jogging. And then this one is hiking. There's intervals, endurance. And then you, you before, like I said, the questionnaire asks you uh, which kind of workouts you like. So I like all those kind of workouts. This is really cool. And then we have my profile up here. Anyways, let me look up on YouTube so I can know exactly how to work this before I start working out. So look, you guys, it also lets you do it manually, and I'm walking right now, so sorry if the camera is shaky, but um, if you want to do it manually, it lets you, you know, just do it manually, and it puts you on, like, a track. You guys, Junior is getting his workout on. He also has a vampire, his Halloween costume on, y'all, his vampire costume. You getting your workout on, Junior? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, now Lisey's getting her workout on.
Hey everybody, sorry about the lighting in advance because I'm currently in the car. I just got my nails done. You guys, I cut them short because about a week ago I fell. And y'all, I fell going up the stairs, okay? And I broke my nail like all the way down. It was bleeding for days, uh, for two days actually. And it was just, it was throbbing. It was very painful. I haven't done that since I was 16. Plus, um, tonight is Thursday night. But starting Monday, I'm going to be starting my workout routines. And even though I do know how to function with long nails because I've been having them for such a long time, it's just really so much easier easier to work out with short nails so I went ahead and cut them down and um, yeah they feel kind of odd to me because I haven't had short nails in probably about a year now anyways I wanted to go into either Hobby Lobby or Joann's but this camera um, battery is about to die and I switched it out when um, before I left but I guess I switched out to a battery that needs to be charged so go figure that the battery is going to die and I'm actually out doing something and I wanted to vlog it a little bit but it looks like I won't be able to. So if I do end up going anywhere when I get back home I will show you guys a haul. I do know one thing it's almost six o'clock and I will not be cooking dinner tonight. So last night I showed you guys that I made Salisbury steak and there just wasn't that many leftovers so I might pick something up I might not but either way when I get back home I will show you or I'll come back on here show you the haul if there is a haul to give and I'll show you what we got to eat if I got anything to eat so I'm at Hobby Lobby you guys I might have to get this from my porch oh my gosh that's so cute but it's $89.99 I need it to be 50% off you guys this is so cool Dolly Parton has a line in Hobby Lobby I love Dolly Parton so cute look at these guitars they're salt and pepper shakers love this Look at this section with the glass Tupperware with the wooden lids. These are super nice. I really, really like these. And they're even starting to carry some redone utensils. Okay, so as you guys seen, I was able to um, film just a little bit in Hobby Lobby before my camera died, but I just wanted to give you guys this small haul. So as you've seen in Hobby Lobby, I pointed out that Dolly Parton has a new line. So I just picked up one of these um, waffle dish mats. Hopefully the color is picking up, but it was $9.99, but all, hello, hold on. It was $9.99, but this was in the spring shop and everything in the spring shop was 40% off. This is what I'm absolutely in love with. This is a cutting board. You guys, this is so freaking cute to me. I absolutely love butterflies and I have a cutting board obsession. So this was right at my alley. This was $19.99, but once again, it was 40% off. And then this is not Dolly. So these two things were Dolly Parton. This is just in the spring shop. So I went ahead and picked up one of these kitchen towels and it was $3.99 with 40% off. And then of course I had to get another apron, which I got to start using my aprons, y'all. I don't want to just keep them on display, but this was $17.99 with 40% off. And then I don't exactly remember when Teacher's Week is, but I know it's coming up in the next like couple weeks. I know everybody's school district and state for the most part, I don't know if it's the same or if it's different, but I do know it's coming up because they had a big old end cap dedicated for teacher stuff. And I'm trying to get like a nice back basket going for Khaleesi and Junior's teachers. So I have one for, and I haven't decided who is going to who, but I think this is more, more of a masculine looking frame and Junior's teacher is a man. And then that one might go to Khaleesi's teacher. Anyway, these were $8.99 each and they were on sale for 50% off. That's not focusing, but they're on sale for 50% off. And this one says the best teachers are those who show you where to look, but don't tell you what to see. That's super cute. And this was the same price. And it says it takes a big heart to help shape little minds. And the reason why I don't have anything here for my oldest daughter's teachers, I don't know if I ever told you guys this, but my daughter is 16 and she graduated from high school a year and a half early. So when COVID hit, she really took advantage and she <laughs> got it going and she, she graduated you guys back in at the beginning of November. So a year and a half early. So she'll be going to college soon, which is absolutely crazy, but that's why I don't have, uh -oh, that's why I don't have anything there for her teachers. And then I picked up this pick. This is really cute. They've had this year after year, but, um, and I thought I had one. It is $5.99. And then this, I won't be using this for spring, but this is so cute for um, summer. My friend Janet told me they had these there and it was $14.99 and I believe it was 50% off. 
And then I was just looking for a big pillow to put in a basket I have in the living room. You guys will see this, see where I put this. If you watch my other channel, I'll show you my um, spring house tour and you'll see it over there. But I just needed a big enough pillow. I didn't want to spend too much money. I don't know if I'm going to put it this way or just turn it around because I basically just want it like a blank canvas. But it, for $11, it was originally $22, but um, it was 50% 50, 50 off the pillows. And then I just picked up some faux eggs for my basket and then some more of this greenery which I have all around my house. And then for dinner we just picked, I picked up some panda for us. Just me and the three kids would eat off these two plates. My husband has leftovers and he does not like Chinese food unless I'm making like chicken fried rice or something. Anyways, I'm uh, so sorry I did not get to show you guys more and that my camera died. But this is going to be the end of today's vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. Until next time everybody, bye.